Hi, I'm Yerida from Include de las Diosas, and today I am going to show you how to personalize your Creative Fabrica downloads. As you know, Creative Fabrica has a lot of different cool things, from fonts to graphics, crafts, I mean, you name it, they have it. Uh, but you need to make sure that as you're selecting uh, these things, um, you select the right licensings from it. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and select the category under the coloring books to see what is available and drill down even further into KDP interiors to see what comes up. Um, on the top of the list are mandalas, which is fantastic because I'm looking forward to have um, some texting over the actual mandala um, coloring area, which is great. As you can see, this one is for commercial and POD usage, which is fantastic. These are the type of licensings that you need to have if you're gonna have for KDP. Um, and I'm gonna leave, uh, leave a, a link below so you can understand the differences between the, those two. I did a video on that. So I'm gonna go ahead and download this one. I think it's, it's a pretty cool uh, Mandela graphics and go straight into Canva, upload it from there. I'm also gonna leave uh, a link below on how to upload PDFs I'm straight into Canva. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this one. This one has uh, only a few pages. I believe it was um, 10 pages, which is fine because for the purpose of this video, I wanted to show you how to personalize it. And what I wanna do is add some sort of affirmation into this, uh, right? So for this one, I'm gonna go ahead and add a heart um, and center it. I'm gonna add another heart and make that one white. So I'm gonna change the color to it so then we have a heart and heart in here and then I'm gonna go into text and find out what's the lettering that will be best for this and this big bold be brave lettering is fantastic um, obviously it's purple I don't need it to be in color I need to be in black so I'm gonna go ahead and change uh, the lining or the line out of the words to be black and there you have it that way they can also color the inside I'm gonna go back into elements and select another shape that will be cool to have. This one, it covers the center really, really well. I'm gonna go ahead and center it. And I'm gonna add another one in here, maybe a circle, um, and then make it white. Just again, playing with the shapes in the different uh, ways that you can just make this fun and different and it still look that is part of the original design for the mandala. Again, select the same bold lettering that we have from before, center it, change the color from purple because we are not doing a color book. We are doing a black and white print on demand book um, to uh, black. I like this wording, be brave. I think it goes perfectly with this mandala um, coloring. And let's do one more. Let's see what other shapes we are able to find in here that are fun and different. Um, let's see. Again, different shapes, different things that you can do. There's this one in the in the middle. They already had some really uh, two tones in here, so you don't need to add a circle on top, you know, of the circle. You can just change the color for the one in the center, and it already has that black lining that I'm looking for anyway which is fantastic. So I'm gonna go ahead again, use the same. Um, and you can just change the text if you wanna change it to something else, just another type of, of font. But I like this one just to keep consistency to what I'm doing. And I'm gonna change it to something like love yourself. Clearly this is a little bit bigger than I expected. So we're gonna go ahead and change and make the font smaller so it will fit in the middle. And then centralize it. So that way it's evenly perfect, right? So as you can see, we did three different things in here, but obviously this book, we need to have the first page, right? That introduction, introductory page to it. So I'm gonna use this text, um, again, changing to something like mandala. And I wanna show you this text has two different tones to it. So obviously we need to remove the coloring. I'm gonna go into effects and change that back orange, which gives that shadow to it. 
um, and make this smaller uh, probably about a hundred will do and then change the word fresh into something like book and make it a bit smaller and move it up so that way is up and center I want to show you also some other elements that you're able to find in here and if I type mandala I'm able to find some really cool things and you can even do a book um, with these elements as well and if you want to create your own um, so again, it's just personalize it because when you purchase stuff from Creative Fabrica, you have to understand, you have to personalize it. You cannot leave it as is, right? That is just an inspiration. That is a guidance on into what you're able to do. But at the end of the day, you're the creator. You have to personalize it. You have to make it different, right? Because you don't want your book to look exactly the same as another book that is over there um, already available on Amazon.com, right? You want to make it different. So... I'm adding some text in here, some copyright information, and I wanted you to see how it's shaping up. Looking good, right? As you can see, it makes it makes a big difference when you add something in the center to make it really cool and different. Um, I also wanted to add something on the back, something like a thank you note for purchasing this. And I like this font. Um, I'm gonna change it to say something like thank you. And obviously this is red and again if you notice this uh, particular font has some uh, background and shadow so go into effect and change it um, see how it pops when you change and have you know gray against that black uh, shadow it makes it really really neat and again just add something fun in that page just to make it nice it's looking good right and again you, you continue to add more pages to it um, you gotta remember that use the uh, PDF print version and download and you are ready to upload into Amazon and your book is ready so hope you like this please subscribe and I'll see you later